guys i am so nervous because i'm at my lip appointment family if you're watching this no you're not let's just pretend this is not happening but oh my god i feel like i could be sick and they keep just going like breathe in breathe out you're gonna be fine i trust this girl wholeheartedly she has done my lips before um but as you can tell i really like that natural minimal look so i'm having 0.5 mil which is the smallest you can have or it's the smallest that she offers i'm just nervous so i'd rather go for the 0.5 just you know give that little bit of an enhancement obviously you can always build whereas it's a lot harder to take away if i have too much and like i said i do really 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 trust the lady she's so nice she's so understanding and i know that she does a really good job so i'm not worried about how they're gonna look i'm just nervous for the pain because if somebody tells you that lip fillers do not hurt they are lying it stings so bad like i do have numbing cream as well but oh oh <laughs> this is what i'm nervous for and i know this lighting's not good i know i don't look my best i've literally got no makeup on obviously um i've got a little spot you know but i just wanted to do a little before because obviously next time you see me i'm gonna have my lips done but yeah here's a before i feel like my bottom lip is smaller than my top only slightly but see what i mean and i just want to get a little bit of definition again in the top and just match the bottom to the top so yeah <gasps> let's go and we are back so i've got gel on which makes them look really shiny and plump basically like lip gloss but it's like arnica gel to help with bruising and swelling and then these little dots that you can see there that's from where she did like the incisions so it's just blood i think but that's normally where you bruise so i know i look a little bit crazy but bear with me i'll do updates throughout the day as well and then i'm getting so i haven't even said in this video and this is not the time to be talking but i'm doing a glow up video for when i go to tenerife next week on friday so i've got a couple of appointments lips nails lashes so i'm doing a little like glow up with me vlog so this is being filmed on saturday getting my nails done on tuesday lashes done on thursday so i'll show you at each appointment what my lips look like just so you can see like how they swell and how they shrink back down but i love how she does them she doesn't do them like ducky she does them like russian so they stay quite flat i've got some arnica cream to put on she's put arnica gel on so i'll wait like a good couple of hours um and then i've got arnica tablets as well these help with the bruising the swelling everything i took a high fever tablet this morning um because that helps with like inflammation and all stuff like that so i just try and do a couple of things so they don't swell up as bad as before let's go it's been about an hour this is like my favorite place to film because don't you think the lighting just looks quite nice let's ignore the state of my skin but this is like an hour update. I feel like some people might think I mean, getting my lips done is going to be a massive transformation, but because I'm such a wimp and I have 0.5, it's not that much of a difference. Like, it's not like, wow, shock app, but obviously I know it. I'm just going to get a warm wet cloth and just wipe off the gel, and then I'm just going to layer the Arnica cream on. And I'm just going to put it all over my lips, obviously. Oh and like around the border like this way i'm just gonna leave it like that and i know it looks crazy but it sinks in really quick so currently sitting on the floor trying to pack my suitcase i'm holding the camera like this because the lighting's really ugly like this but i'm just gonna try and put everything in my case now so i know what i've got if i need anything but here's a little lip update i've just ate some garlic bread and it was a little bit difficult it's been like two hours um help me help me someone help this is my four hour update they're swelling up so bad you can see it all here that they're swollen hello let's ignore the state of me i had my lips on on saturday and now it's tuesday so these are the lips now i've just put vaseline on to make them look nicer but to be fair i feel like my top lips not swollen at all like i might be wrong in saying that but when I'm touching it and like putting the cream and everything on, it doesn't feel like swollen at all. Whereas the bottom lip still does feel quite like squishy like this, which makes me think it's still swollen. I really like them, to be honest. And when I lean back like this, I feel like it looks like I've got a really big bottom lip. But I don't know if that's just because I've put loads of Vaseline on. 
and again it's still swollen and like the shadow underneath makes it look bigger but today's tuesday like i said i've just finished work and that's why i look like this because i just never make an effort but tomorrow's my last day at work how crazy is that and then i leave and start my new job after my holiday so it's going to be an end of an era but today the reason why i'm vlogging is because i'm getting my nails done not going to do a close-up because they are disgusting um but i really don't know what to get i was a french tip gal through and through for literally years i'm not gonna lie but the last time i got my nails done i had this like pink and orange and they were just really pretty so the lighting is not a vibe it's like what is going on i really feel like i've gone off french tip finally so my dilemma is my holiday outfits the daytime outfits are very neutrals plain my bikinis i've got like a bikini in every color and then on the nighttime outfits most of my outfits are blue orange or neutrals so i was gonna say pink nails because pink is my favorite color and it's not that people really care like i don't think people are gonna go oh my god she's got pink nails and a blue outfit but you know and it just doesn't match i'll stop talking in a sec i promise but i think we're gonna do the normal base color and then a little bit of color but we'll see good morning i promise this whole vlog's not gonna be me just sitting in the car but today's thursday i was meant to be going to get my lashes done i was meant to be getting a lash lift um but my lash ladies had to cancel on me unfortunately so now i'm thinking do i message someone that i've never been to and ask them or do i just leave it because i feel like it's risky business isn't it like when you don't know how someone's work is not it? it's like a perm so i really don't want my eyelashes to fall out we'll just leave it at that but i'm going to go into town now i need to go to primark i need to go to boots this is going to be going like a running around vlog i was literally just going to vlog me getting stuff done but i might as well just make it a little bit longer and just bring you with me like a little chill vlog Here's my lips, they're looking a bit dry. These are my healed now, I don't think they're silent anymore. They feel really like flat now, they don't feel as like squishy or anything. So yeah, I love them. Anyway, let's go shopping. Guys, I just got this little, like, look how little that is, after sun, for £7.40. Is that a joke? £7, look at the size of it. Probably won't even last me the week. I am back with a big fat haul. I have got some pretty boring stuff, but I have got some fun stuff as well. So, first things, boring, most expensive thing I got, a new toothbrush. I've had my toothbrush probably about two years and it's just decided to stop charging. This was 35 pounds. Sorry, what, 35 pounds? I mean, I know you use it every day and it's really important and all that business, but during your life, 35 pounds though, really? Now, if this is what I think it is, I am going to be absolutely over the moon excited because I ordered this really cute little like play seat thing from holiday and it said shipping date was the 20th to the 24th of June. I went on holiday on the 23rd, so I was like, you've got the 20th, the 21st and the 22nd to arrive. Should be fine. Then I had an email once I brought it saying it was coming the day after I leave. But then I haven't ordered anything else on Amazon, so let's see. Because if this is what I think it is, yes! 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 Thank God. I am so excited for these. I hope it fits me. I don't even know if it will. All my daytime outfits for holiday are like neutrals, really plain Jane. So I feel like I just needed something to just spice it up. If this is too big, I'm gonna cry. It might be too big. She might be too ugly. <laughs> Why is it? I mean she looked a lot cuter on the model. I don't think it's going to be too big. It probably just won't snatch me, but I didn't want it to be too tight where it was like, <sharp inhale> do you know what I mean? So hopefully, I'll try it on. But the vision was cute. Obviously, just wear it open like that wee little bikini underneath. And it's like a little pair of shorts. I'm really glad it's came. Let's just hope it actually fits me. From Primark, I got this little beach bag. It is literally the Prada dupe. I feel like the Prada one literally just says Prada there. But I've seen it a few times because it has been in Primark for a little while. And I kept just walking past it. And they do it in pink as well and green, I think. And I kept thinking, oh, it's nice, but I don't need it. But I need it to be able to hold two towels. So I'm thinking I could fit one towel here and one towel here. It just looks a bit bigger than the one I've got and a lot cuter. So this was £10. Then I got some really boring stuff. I got some hairspray, some moisturiser, my £7 after sun and just some roll-on deodorant. I literally look a mess and... I don't know why the lighting keeps going so weird. I don't know. But I find it so funny that I'm going to call this my glow up video. Look at the state of me. Look at the state of me. I'm so shiny off the sunbed. 
my hair is very frizzy but i haven't straightened it or anything i've just dried it so anyway anyway moving on i've got a boohoo parcel which i'm also really excited for i saw a girl that i follow on tiktok do a haul with this in and i was like i actually just need it do you know what i mean it's like one of those where it's like i need it and i, I thought if it's more than 15 pounds i'm not gonna buy it eight pounds in the sale bargain i don't it looks like that material where it's going to be see-through but it says california west coast and it's got a little bit of pink and these little lemons but i was thinking wear it in the day just over to my bikini for a cute little pic or i might wear it on one of the nights as well um i've got like this long maxi skirt and i might just make this a little bit more cropped and then just wear it with the maxi skirt but we will see we will see I got some body tape. I really wanted it to be a bit thicker. I don't know if you can tell, it's really thin. And I don't know if that's going to like hold and secure me. So I'm just going to have to do a couple of strips. But this was the only size that I had and I couldn't get any from anywhere else. And then I got some hair bubbles, which is just like standard. Because all my hair bubbles are like ripping my hair out. Just got some jelly bangers. Woohoo! Fun times. And that's my little haul. Very, very excited. I need to pack my suitcase. I need to do something with my hair. I need to dye I need to dye my eyebrows. I'm gonna do that next, I think. Because they don't look too bad, but they are quite gappy, so it's time to dye my eyebrows. I'm using, I'll show you what set it is, but I'm literally just going really messy. I think you're meant to use like a little brush, but I haven't got one. Can you hear the birds? Do the mind. I mean, I am being very messy, if you couldn't tell. I'm gonna do something with my hair as well because it actually looks disgusting. And then I'm just gonna clean it up a little bit. Ta-da, easy peasy. I've obviously got to wait and let it sit, but I feel like that has definitely done the job. Shape boys, we don't look too bad. This is the tint I'm using. I just got it from Boots. My friend Laura always uses it, but it literally says to leave it on for one to five minutes. This is my suitcase situation. My suitcase is full, and then I've got all this extra stuff that I need to include. I didn't know whether to do a compact with me video or not, because I feel like I always do them. But I don't know if people actually enjoy them or if they're a bit boring. Do you know what I mean? But I kind of like filming them, because I feel like it's just the holiday build-up. But I don't know. We'll see. This is the final result. Woo! I mean, my hairs just don't grow there, but but like this, you really can't tell. And I feel like it just freshens them up so much, makes them look fuller. I just need to pluck these little tiny bits. But I think I am going to film a pack with my video because I'm just thinking, why not? Do you know what I mean? So, and it will motivate me to actually sort out my suitcase. So I'm going to go and do that now. But I think I might just end the video here, to be honest, because I'm going to go and start that other video. Like I said, so I might as well get this edited and uploaded, ready to go. My next vlogs are going to be my Tenerife holiday vlogs. Woo! I don't know whether I'm doing one or two, we'll see how long the videos are, but I literally can't wait. Hope you guys enjoyed this little chatty vlog, getting ready for my holiday. Please make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!